did not expect this to immediately erupt into a pitched battle. Great. Hello, everyone. Good morning, good evening, whatever you may be. My name is Endub, and welcome back to Elite Dangerous. Once again, the story of Lake on Dynamics. Uh, I mean, the core dynamics and Lake on Space Maze has taken a turn as allegations of illegal practices have surfaced after it came to light that some Lake on shareholders sold stock options to shell companies that were quietly being operated and controlled by portions of uh, Core Dynamics, as well as some accusations of alleged blackmail. At the new chairman of Lake on Spaceways, mind you, this is one of uh, C the uh, CEO Jupiter Rochester of uh, Core Dynamics is selected replacements has dismissed all of these claims as simply the Alliance Council of Admirals simply being salty about losing exclusivity with a military contractor. Meanwhile, in the more uh, commercial skullduggery and uh, backstabbing news, the Utopia Commune has had its ability to even host a uh, diplomatic conference between the Alliance Federation and Empire challenged by everyone's favorite discount emperor. Li Yong Rui, CEO of Sirius Corporation, has stated that, and now I'm paraphrasing here, the private army, neutrality, logistical command, resources, and political connections of the Sirius Corporation would be far better suited to hosting a diplomatic conference between the big three superpowers and then a single planetary government of galactic fringe hippies. Regardless, both Sirius Corporation and the Utopia Communes the proposals are now being compared and considered by potential attendees, and I am curious as to how this will all go down. A piece is always a good choice, but who knows. And as for Dark Wheel news, we are now preparing to move into the area of the Soul System uh, to test a couple of things. I believe if I've read the brief correctly, this is to see if the Dark Wheel cur has the ability to uh, give out the permit to Soul. An extreme unlikelihood given that uh, that system permit is uh, earned through rank progression through the Federation Navy. Although personally I think all humans should have the capability to at least visit the cradle system of humanity at the leisure. But that is neither here nor now. And more importantly, if the Dark Wheel can actually move into the solar system naturally through the use of the background simulation mechanics. Uh, similarly, we are also in the final stages of preparing our jump into the LFT-509 region of space for a similar test. A long row to hoe indeed, and yet we are almost there. And now, why am I in Anyanwu? Why am I in the anomalous resource? And why am I headed to this compromised, uh, compromised navigation beacon? Well. Now the Dark Wheel, as you know, has taken over several systems, a vast network of systems, and now it is our duty to maintain the peace. Considering that uh, we are the controlling faction in these systems, we are the shepherds of, the, of the, those places. And that is why I'm headed to this CMB, to hunt pirates. And we shall see just how well this goes. I have been having uh, connection errors for quite... Um, not a long time, just it's been the last 40 minutes. Just connection error, connection error, connection error. And I actually was in the middle of uh, recording this episode earlier when that happened, and it threw me completely off. But we shall see, and one of the great things about compromised nav beacons, I am not even going to touch that, because I that is an anaconda. At least. Yep, Anaconda. Dangerous Anaconda. He's clean. Hmm. If he's gonna get swarmed by pirates, I may want to help. Uh, let's see. Sepulchre. Ah, he's in a three man wing, though. 
Okay, he fired the first shot. Oh wait, wrong button. Yeah, definitely help my dark wheel brethren on this. Even though it's gonna be a very large and crazy battle. Yes, I know the temperature is critical because I don't have the optimized weapon for this. Well, he's just paying me no mind. Yeah, way too close on that. I figured that was a long shot, but if I nailed him, that would've been pretty cool. I did not expect this to immediately erupt into a pitched battle. Frick! Why are you scanning me, Mike? He's elite, that's dangerous. Let's see what this Cobra is doing. If I'd had to hazard a guess, the Anaconda already ate it. Clean. I know this Vulture is far faster than I am. He's also Dark Wheel, bruh. Utah, deadly, wanted, but he's in a wing. He's also in a wing. Uh, DBS, who about you? He's probably in that wing too. I just rammed and scanned someone. Or scan and ram. No, he's not a cop. I mean, he's not a pirate. Okay. Thought for sure he was going to be a pirate. Scan detected. Viper Mark IV. Do I see gunshots off in the distance? Clean. I do. Boris the Anvil is clean. How about this other crate? Probably not. Wait, was that a dark wheel ship fighting a dark wheel ship? No. But unfortunately, you have. Uh... Stop! You violated the law! There we go, power plant. Flying in at me from the sun? Or running away from me into the sun? That's what it looks like. In those he done goofed.
Get back here, you rat bastard. Not only have you violated the law, you have sullied the name of the Dark Wheel. Unfortunately, the crate is uh, a little bit more maneuverable than I am. Shooting missiles? Because that's what it seemed like. I saw missiles. Maybe that was a... Uh, Cord is power plant though at this point. Yeah, this is why I want I normally fit uh, pulse lasers, not burst. Faster, damn it. There we go. What about this guy? Deep Penitent. Interesting name. Wanted. Partnership of Anyan Wu. He's got rail guns. Great. Where's the power plant on it? On that, anyway. Kind of a curious as to that. Actually, is he leaving uh, that pass? No, he's not. Interesting. It just seems to be leaving it. I don't want to mess with a chieftain today. While I am hunting pirates, I do want to be a little bit selective as to what I'm hunting. Crawlosaur, yeah, crawlosaur, dangerous brotherhood. But that is a bit of a break. Well, I am going to keep at this for the rest of the night, at least I plan to anyway. Thank you all for watching, feel free to like, comment, and subscribe, and click that little bell for notifications, and to join me in my eternal crusade against YouTube and its sorting algorithms. And hopefully I will see you all in the next video.